Yeah, we're back again, and the time has finally arrived to test this thing. I'm um, working all day on the uh, on the first the plastic housing. Fix those two broken lugs for the monitor, one there and then there. Repair those, mounted the monitor, remounted the um, analog board, and I've rewired it all according to the photographs I took as I took this thing apart. I've searched for every goddamn thing I can find to see what's, you know, if there's any problems. I've looked for shorts, corrosion, dry solder joints, bulging capacitors. I can't find anything. Um, it looks sweet, I'll tell you that much. I just pray to God it works. I mean, this is Christmas Eve night. What time is it? It's 20 to 11 in Ireland on Christmas Eve, and I do not want to fucking end up in hospital. And uh, there it is from the front. It's looking pretty sweet now, look. I mean, oh, wouldn't it be nice if this thing comes on? There's a pot in the front. Uh, I haven't had much success it's in, in securing it, but it's there. Before I kill this thing and switch it on, um, here's the two bolts I had to put in today. One here and one here to make those things so I've given it a wipe of uh, isopropyl or alcohol no, acetone I said I get wiped it down to make it look lovely and clean and uh, so that's it but it looks messy but that's I mean the thing was a mess from day one but that's it like I'm gonna go through it one more time I have the, I have the plug ready it's all ready to be plugged in Jesus I don't like this and uh, especially on Christmas Eve, like, you know, could you not think of a better time to do it? <clears throat> I've been at it all day, it's Christmas Eve, and I've been putting all these posts up in the 68K Liberation Army um, for advice and for help and for extra eyes to check what I've done to see, uh, hope if anyone could see anything I've done wrong. This spring, I don't know what it does, it's some kind of art. I have it just going from here to here. One side I looked at it said it's supposed to go to here on the yoke, but I can't say anywhere to connect it maybe onto that, but that that's broken over there, so I, I don't know what to do with it. But it's just inert, so we're gonna plug it in anyway. <clears throat> it's not really a good time to be doing this, man, but hey. So let's just get this thing on the ground and get ready to plug it in. Okay. Okay, this is it. We're going to plug it in. Um, from taking it apart. <sighs> okay, um, we have the power in. It's not plugged in. I got, all I've got to do is plug it in now and fit the switch. And yet yeah, again, I am fucking terrified as to what's going to happen here. This is a white wire just hanging here. This is from the motherboard. I imagine it's some kind of ground. These, this switch here pops out the front. And these two wires here, this is the one that went onto the back of the Visex graphics card or on slot 4. These two were left lying in, in air, I don't know what they're for. But it seems that this single wire, with two wires that wired onto the analog board, is what's carrying the signal to put the image on the display. And fuck, I'm terrified, man. This thing could explode. And uh, yeah, we're good to go, so. I think we'll to find out, plug it in, switch it on. So we're going to check the camera again that, yeah, we are filming this. And glasses on. And this could go bang in a big way, because this thing's got a flyback transformer and I don't fucking like this one bit. So. Oh, Christ, I'm right underneath it again. In three, two... One. No here. No image, no display. Power is on and nothing. Oh crap, I don't like this. Stop, power off. There's no one off switch this time because that, that lead is going straight in now unless I lose connection on this stupid fucking thing which I've had before. Try the other socket. <clears throat> I 
So we'll try again. Three, two, one. Nothing. Prairie pool. Oh fuck me, we have this bit. It worked. Holy shit, it worked. Okay, turn it off, turn it off, then I smoke. No. Uh, now what do I do? Christ, it worked. Look at that boy. We getting this? Ha, <laughs> look at that. We have a CRT, that's, that's green. Oh man, don't be fucking around with this and keep the glasses on. I imagine this is brightness. Yeah, there you go. Fuck me, it's working. Cool. <laughs> How cool is that? Now we've got a fully charged flyback transformer and a capacitor. Which could blow up and kill me. Keep the glasses on. No, no sign of smoke, no burning. Jeez, it worked. Yeah, man. Um, wow. That's pretty cool, like. And it's steady, isn't it? it and he said, no, it's just, there's a bit of flicker on it. Is it consistent? Should I power it off? Should I see what these switches do? There's a switch on the back here, I'm gonna power it off. Yes! Cool! Hey! <laughs> Is that thing still recording? Yeah, we got it. Uh, now there's a little switch on the back. Jesus, this could be life, it's just back of the hand. No, I'm not dead yet. That's plastic. Uh, the chassis. No. Okay. I'm gonna flick the switch. Don't know what it does, but we just flipped it. Like I said, that's the 2K, the 4K resolution, obviously. Like it has to be. We're gonna power back up again with that switch flicked. See what this does. Nothing. And. Jesus, yeah, we have a display. So, mission successful. So now we have that crazy tra um, round transformer thing working. Actually, the, the vertical sync thing it seems to be going a bit different. And, uh, and this is the signal, like, this, this is the signal going to the analog board. Don't know what them words do. But uh, yeah, we have a CRT. Only God knows when this thing was last switched on. But that's pretty cool. I'm well impressed. Cool, look at that monitor, man. <laughs> Let's just bring this, I'm terrified to move anything. Look, it should be safe enough. Although the, the analog board is just held at the bottom, so I should be able to turn this thing safely. Yeah, it's just a power lead, and that's two wires, so... Can we turn this without getting to this? Oh, Jesus. A little bit low voltage, because they're the signal. I imagine that comes from the graphics card. It's wired onto the analog board. Oh, look at that. I think that's working now. There's a bit of strange flicker on the top. I'm gonna to flick the switch while it's on. Is that a good or a bad note? While it's off, so looking at that flicker. Cool. Now you've probably got a crazy glare on um, on the uh, from the camera here. But that's this lovely shade of green. It's on now a few minutes and there's no sign of smoke. The dog is still out the back. 
<laughs> I'm pretty impressed with <laughs> my own stupidity, why? You see, old age, you see, tech night, you were saying, ripping apart already. If I did, I would have broke all the wires, not knowing where they went. You see? Oh, it's finding something rather strange. It smells like an old telly, so I'll turn it off again. Cool, Jesus. There is a strange smell. But it's not a bad smell. It could be some of the acetone down the end. I see a little bit of dampness down in the very bottom corner. Next to this little tiny circle, whatever this thing is for. We flick that back. And we also have this switch here. So we'll put it back and see if the display is the same though. We switch it back on. Don't blow up, please don't blow up. It seems to be at an angle. But hey, I'm pretty happy with that. Now it's starting to wobble a bit. Let's just watch and see what it get worse. If it is, that means something's overheating. Yeah. Yeah, it's all twisted. But they're the controls on the back of the yoke, aren't they? But let's just see if it's stable, but it'll get worse. No sign of any smoke. On some of the Mac 6800s I worked on, whenever you have analog board problems, you can switch on the computer and the monitor is fine after a few minutes and it starts crapping out. Holy shit, it worked. That is beautiful, man. But hey, that's a big improvement from where it was the other day, like taking out the box. Man, I, I took straw from inside this fucking thing. I, I, I'd say it was in, in, in a barn out in Ireland somewhere, you know, in a farmyard. And a shitload of dead insects from the end of it. Uh, yeah. Let's lower the brightness. It takes the load off the CRT. Up to max. That's fucking pushing the harbour. That's max. Bring it back down. Oh, man. Now that could still be dead, I don't know, but that's something. And it's got this little wavy pattern. Oh, whoa, 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 I don't know. Maybe it's got to do with how they are doing. Does that have any effect on this thing? Because this is the signal. From what I gather, these two are the signal inputs for the display. So it must be like coaxial, you know, just... Although, Chris, no, just two wires. I don't know, I don't... It's not fucking live, is it not? No. Excellent. That seems pretty stable. All we need now is a signal. Let's see how it, how it works out. No, it's just, there's no bad smell there at all. So this is a Fallon 5 out in Ireland, boy. Hey, hey. Catch you later, man.